We're outside the Royal Ad Hospital on North Terrace and you see the tram, which is very obvious, stops here and we're at bus stop B2. The sign is showing us that bus stop B2 is dealing with bus 281. In that direction it's going to Paradise, but the question is what if you're coming from the other direction? You have to do some a lot of research to discover that bus 286, 287 or 288 from West Lakes <coughs> has come here. The question is, how do you return back to West Lakes? Is it the bus stop over there or the bus stop over here or somewhere else? This is a real magical mystery tour, finding out how to return back home again, having arrived at the Royal Adelaide Hospital by bus. You can see that the road's been very carefully crafted so buses can pull into this bus stop and not interfere with road traffic on the main road in North Terrace. The 281 bus just pulling in. The question is where do we catch the bus to return back to? The western side of Adelaide. So the buses stopping at bus stop B2 are the 286, the 287, the 288. The 286 operates Monday to Fridays. The 287 operates seven days a week. Hospitals operate seven days a week. And uh, 288 operates Monday to Fridays. And we can see that they go from either Henley Beach or West Lakes to the city. Now we can see that when buses reach the city, at some point they turn into the 281 buses for most of the time during the busy day. The rush periods, some terminate at these magic bus stops. So nowhere here is it mentioning any significant landmarks. D and I1. This is the map showing the city and we'll see in fact D is the Adelaide Railway Station and I1 is the old Ra. The old Ra used to be there, it's now here at the other end of North Terrace and B2 is not of any significance, even though this is one of the major places where nurses and staff and cleaning staff and day patients from the western suburbs may need to come. And we can see that Y2 is shown in this position on the other side of the road. If we go to Adelaide Metro Zone website about stop B2 on North Terrace. You see it talks about the 281 bus which is on the sign at the bus stop but also 286, 287 and 28 and as we've seen 281 and the 286 and 28 are the same bus and also talks about this Bedford industry and that runs in the morning on one occasion from the bus stop outside the new Ra hospital. Up ahead on West Terrace is a much closer bus stop for old barn buses and buses which also go into places like Mount Bark. On the other side of the 
bridge over the railway line is the location for the new Women's and Children's Hospital. And looking back along the North Coast. It looks like they actually stopped buses coming here anymore at bus stop Y2. And this is the Royal Ada Hospital with the tram stop outside. So we're seeing that bus stop B2 talks about the 281 bus. <coughs> and this is the timetable showing it goes from Paradise Interchange to the city and that it operates seven days a week, as hospitals do, except there's a special service, the 281X, which goes from Clemsig on the weekends. So we can see it's Paradise Interchange and it doesn't follow the O-Bahn to the city but we do see that all these 281 buses turn into 286s or 288s during the day. This shows the route, Paradise Interchange, the yellow is the O-Bahn, the bus rapid transit with, with only one stop from Paradise into the city whereas the 281 bus follows the normal roads and when it comes to this point it joins the busway which runs down Hackney Road but it doesn't go into the tunnel which goes under the parklands <coughs> and instead it follows the old route around Botanic Road into North Terrace and takes us to I-1 which is the old Ra and D is the Adelaide Railway Station so I-1, the old Ra Railway Station and Y-2 and there's some kind of mention here that more prominence image of the Royal Adelaide Hospital. So at some point between I1 and Y2 buses change their numbers. So if you go off the bus here from the western suburbs at the Ra, if you try to catch a bus a bit further along the road after being at the hospital you might go on in into C or doctors or other businesses in the city, you'd be confused about which bus to catch because you came on one bus, but the bus is going through a process of changing over to a different kind of bus number. So this is the Royal Ada Hospital and the bus stop we just saw, and this is the bus stop on the other side, the Y2 bus, and you see that the Y2 bus stop gives you no indication of what bus to stop here and you have to hail the bus. Lots of buses go past here that don't stop here Then you have to know what the numbers are and as we saw before the number of the bus has changed from what it was coming from Paradise to here. Here comes the 288 bus. Stopping at the Y2 bus stop. If we go to Adelaide Metro's own website and look at bus stop Y2 on North Terrace on the south side, it shows that the 281 bus, the 286. 287 and 28, we actually know that the 281 and the 286 are the same bus, depending upon whether it's changed its number or not. So there's some confusion there. But it's also showing bus 613, which is the Prince Alfred College to City bus, and then talks about the Bedford Group to City bus. None of that information is actually shown on the post at the bus stop. And we can see that the 613 bus 
Prince Albert College to City operates once a day. Bus stop Y1, North Terrace Adelaide, the University of Adelaide Medical School in front of us there and behind that is the USA building. And this is the new building being built at the moment. Search building and then the Royal Adelaide Hospital. So it's a bit of a walk now from here to get to the Royal Adelaide Hospital. I will use the footpath. So this is bus stop Y2. You can see it's not a very good position for a bus stop because cars are also trying to do left hand turns. This is bus stop B1 on this terrace. Bus 140 to Glen Osborne, 141, 142, 144, 147. The 500 bus, 501 and 502 buses are actually the 110 bus from Westlakes. And change. And what they've done is they've changed their number to these numbers. They are going to go. To Elizabeth Horson Wright. At bus stop X1, the 110, which used to be the 500 bus stops here, the 112, 115, 117, 118, 150, 155, 157. So these buses you would alight or get off at this stop and Catch the bus on the other side. People who, to, people who want to use the public transport to come to the Royal Adelaide Hospital would, a lot of them would only be able to come by bus. So if we go to the bus page and we go down to the bottom of that section, it says alterations have been made to public transport services in the lead up to the RAS opening on September 5. We're now looking at the web page in 2022, which is five years later. These changes include new bus stops and rerouting of some existing services. Stop Y1 will be introduced on North Terrace. Stop Y1 will be located east of Y2, just east of New Market Street. The Primary Hills Bus Route 864 will be rerouted to operate in one directional loop from Curry Street to the hospital via Morford Street and North Terrace. So this is a major enhancement for people living in the hills, but it does introduce a different way where the one bus stop is where you get off and is also the one bus stop where you get on again at the to, to return to where you, where you come. It also says that the C1, Elizabeth, interchange to the city and the C2, Greenwith, to the city services, will be rerouted to service the hospital from 3rd of September. These services will travel via their normal route along Greenhill, Curry Street and then to Morford Street and stopping off the hospital. But it doesn't say here where it's going to stop. It doesn't say where it's going to stop. And also, it doesn't tell us that's the same as the Hills bus where it's a loop and the stop you get off at is also the stop where you return to to catch the same bus back to where you came from. This is a rather unusual different thing for Adelaide because normally the bus stop you get off is opposite the bus stop where you would catch the bus to return from where you came. The thing that's wrong here, of course, is the C1 and C2 buses do not, no longer come from Elizabeth. In fact, that old system got changed and the C1 and C2 don't come here at all. In fact, it's the 540, 541 that come to this new position here from the Oban. Many, many people would rely upon their mobile phones to help them when they want to travel. And if we go to Google, and type in bus stops near Royal Adelaide Hospital. It comes up with 
the B2 bus stop on North Terrace, the Y2 on North Terrace, the B2 on West Terrace, the B1 on West Terrace, and the Y1 on North Terrace, and the X1 on West Terrace. All these bus stops are actually the buses, bus stops that people would have to use to get to and from the hospital. The interesting information, however, is that in some cases it's wrong. For example, if we go to the Y1 bus stop, it's showing the 501, 502 as stopping at Y1. They don't. They're actually similar to the example we've got regarding the early part of the video where the 501, 502 changed their number and that those buses actually stop over here on West Terrace at X1. So if you were trying to catch the 500 bus, you actually have to catch it here at the B on West Terrace. So the critical information online is as confused as the, as the customers about how this whole system has been deployed there's so much complexity in terms of using public transport buses here at the hospital that the patronage is obviously right down to almost nothing. As we saw earlier, the only person getting on the bus on Y2 was a student from a high school. No one from the hospital was using it.